Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Reverts here, and today I'm going to give you guys a little recap about Call of Duty Ghosts, all the information that we know, all the information that I know, and uh, I'm going to tell you guys that, so, uh, you know, just in case you guys are kind of lazy, you know, for like watching the whole trailer or whatever, uh, then this video is right for you. So, I've got a lot of cover and a little amount of time, so let's get started fast. Okay, so the first thing that we have is to create a soldier customization. And uh, Infinity Ward, they've added a whole bunch of new ways to customize your Call of Duty Ghost character. And uh, you can choose to be a male or a female character. And uh, you can just choose a whole bunch of stuff, guys. Like, you can have different sexes and stuff like that. Uh, you can change your helmets, your, uh, your clothing wear. There's just so much stuff that you can change with your character. And that is pretty cool. We did see a little bit of that coming in the Call of Duty uh, Black Ops 1. But uh, it wasn't that fully uh, operational. It wasn't that uh, good. But they make uh, character customization really, really good in this game. So uh, that is one new thing that they've added. And another thing is the perk system. They basically, uh, Infinity War, change up the whole perk system. And there's a total of 35 perks in Ghost, guys. And uh, between each perk, you have a value between 1 and 5. And uh, you'll get 8 perks to use on, like, one perk. And you get to choose which ones you want. And uh, the perks in Call of Duty Ghost, they've been divided into 7 sections. The 7 sections are Speed, Healing, Stealth, Awareness, Resistance, Equipment, and Elite. And uh, yeah, guys, that's basically what they did. Um, the names are pretty self-explanatory. There are some perks that are in recent Call of Duty games that are in uh, each of those seven different categories. But I'm not going to go over them all because I don't have that much time. Maybe I'll make a new video about that. But yeah, guys, there's a whole bunch of new perks now, 35 perks. And they've been divided into seven categories that you can choose. So the next thing we have on our list is kill streaks, and uh, they decided to make the assault strike package kill streak. They added the assault strike package and the support strike patch package back into the game, and uh, yeah, so that is pretty cool to see those return. And also the specialist strike package. So uh, maybe there might be uh, the Moab. You know how you'd had in Mono for three if you had a specialist kill streaks, you'd get the Moab on the. Uh, 25th one, I don't know, maybe, maybe they added that, maybe they didn't, I'm not that sure, guys, so, uh, yeah, but, um, the other thing that we have is the new game modes, and they've added, uh, about seven new game modes, actually, in Call of Duty Ghost, that's to keep the game a little bit fresh and whatever, so, uh, the new game modes are Search and Rescue, Grind, Blitz, Cranked, Infected, Hunted, and Safeguard, and uh, what, it, what some of you guys may think that Infected is similar to uh, the Modern Warfare 3 game mode. Well, uh, it is. That is basically all the information that I know. So uh, I'm thinking that it's kind of like Modern Warfare 3, but it's uh, Modern Warfare 3 Infected. But uh, they might have added a couple of twists and stuff like that. So. Uh, yeah, guys, those are the new seven new game modes. And finally, the last thing is the Call of Duty Elite. And uh, basically, when Infinity War... I made a commentary about this, actually, a while uh, back about the Call of Duty Ghost uh, Clan v. Clan playlist. But basically, what they did is they've added a whole bunch of... Uh, new competitive stuff basically um, they made the whole clan v clan playlist like I said in the old video um, excuse me guys so you can also uh, communicate via messages and stuff like that through Call of Duty Elite they basically just really touch based with the whole Call of Duty Elite they're using their Call of Duty Elite because nothing then they haven't really uh, gone for uh, in detail with the whole Call of Duty Elite, Elite thing now they've added like a whole bunch of new stuff guys and that is so cool I really like Call of Duty Elite when it first came out guys and uh, I'm glad to see that they are bringing that back and they're making it more uh, better for the community, more better for the competitive side of Call of Duty. So guys, that's my little recap on Call of Duty Ghost about the whole multiplayer trailer. And uh, yeah, if you want me to cover anything else in uh, later videos, please leave me a comment down below. Also, I would really appreciate it if you could leave a like because uh, this video took a lot to do. I had to go research and stuff like that. And I really appreciate it if you guys would leave a like. Uh, likes are always welcome. And, you know, all the ghost information, it's really, really complicated to go find some uh, information. And you have to do them fast, too, without any bigger YouTuber uh, trying to get them. And then they get all the... Uh, people are watching they already know but uh, I really want to bring my subs the best content that I can I want to bring my subs uh, the first content like the the, like the very first content that was ever created on the, about the whole Call of Duty Ghost information because uh, you guys have done so much for me. You guys are really, really awesome people and I love you guys so much. So, uh, yeah, guys, if you really appreciate it, you can leave a like and comment on this video. And also subscribe if you would like to see more Call of Duty Ghost information. And, yeah, guys, thank you for watching. This is Reverts, and I'll catch you all later. Peace.